Hi everybody, uh, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to talk about terminal applications. Why do you want to use it and uh, what are the advantages of, I mean, using a terminal application over in you know, a complete GUI. Uh, so first thing, probably many of my viewers are coming from Mac and Windows and uh, they are not so familiar uh, interacting the PC with the keyboard. I mean, they are not used to receive text back from, from a terminal. Uh, but uh, yeah, why would you like to do uh, to interact with your PC with a keyboard? So first thing, uh, what you don't want to do is, uh, is to switch context between keyboard and mouse all the time. This is uh, something that uh, a lot of people are used to and it looks like very natural but uh, it's uh, annoying and in the way kind of that you need to constantly you know move your hands around i'm all for you know mini mi minimizing uh, context switch or even keyboard presses to accomplish a goal and uh, switching in a GUI application sometimes you need to insert some text sometimes you need to click something and it's just annoying and in the way uh, the terminal uh, basically you can interact in the terminal with just the keyboard so this avoids a lot of distractions second thing i don't like to see many things on my screen in general i usually use a full uh, a terminal that's full screen so there are no buttons no 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 stuff on on my on my screen and this is uh, uh, because i don't like to be distracted so it's uh, Everything, every extra information that's on the screen, every button, the date, the power is mostly just a distraction, notification. I know that people, they don't care much uh, about screen real estate, they don't use styling window managers, uh, but uh, those things get in the way of your work. So if you have like a black terminal with something written on, you don't have chances to be distracted. You are fully focused on a task. And this is uh, one main reason why I use the terminal. Then I'll give you another reason. So GUI application change all the time. So what you learn is not uh, how to solve a task, but is the implementation of a program. So if the programmer one day wants to change the location of a button or the menu, uh, things that, I mean, it happens all the time. Yeah, I remember uh, in 2003 when I used Word, I mean, the interfaces changed completely since then. So learning the implementation of something is kind of dumb. What you want to do is to learn how to solve problems and the GUI generally gets you in the way. Uh, another reason is that uh, terminal programs or POSIX uh, standard, uh, is, uh, it doesn't change over time. So once you learn how to do some basic text manipulation, then you are good to go. Uh, terminal programs are generally more modular because it's all text-based and the terminal is the right tool to modify in uh, uh, text. So a program gives you some text and the text uh, can be manipulated and given to another program and so on and uh, this makes your system more modular uh, so programs are generally smaller it's not always the case uh, there are very big programs uh, written for terminal applications uh, but uh, in general uh, it's more modular you use commands simple commands that go to other commands and that's how you can automate a lot of stuff and create your own system because the system needs to make sense for you it shouldn't make sense for other people. It's your PC, and if you write your script, uh, it's just better to repeat, you know, the clicks all the time, uh, look uh, where the wind, where the button is, click on the menu and click other things. You can just, you know, automate everything in a script, and that's uh, and that's it. So that's. Uh, uh, another reason is because it's consistent. If you if you look uh, generally between uh, GUI programs, everything changes. Whereas uh, a Mac user or Windows user that never saw a command prompt, 
then you can use different programs and they will not notice that you are in different programs so that that terminal is generally that consistent uh, which which is very nice and pretty I assume another thing uh, it's the way to interact so if you write a command you give is like nicer to give your PC commands and uh, respond so it's a very more uh, it's a interactive way to to uh, play with your computer which is uh, I think very nice if you tell what to do and the computer actually does it uh, yeah GUI applications you don't know what's going on on the background it, I mean also with terminal application some application you don't know but uh, in general it's way easier to kill and I mean interact with your programs like it feels like that you're controlling actually your machine which is I mean not obvious uh, nowadays uh, a lot of people are used to be spied and uh, you know uh, another thing is uh, given the nature of terminal application there are a lot of people that develop terminal application it's very easy so you have a lot of more programs that run in the terminal it's very easy to get a program and I mean everybody can write for instance the grab function uh, in one afternoon whereas coming up with uh, Microsoft Word or I don't know another big program it will take much uh, much more time so you have kind of a lot of programs that you take on and you make sense out of them uh, so yeah these are the main reasons why you should use terminal applications uh, having said that uh, please uh, let me know what you think uh, in the comments if you are still uh, hanging around uh, this is my first video, so I would love to hear your your comments. Uh, second thing, I mean, I will improve the audio. I bought a microphone, and uh, so please give me feedbacks on the quality uh, of the audio and video. Let me know. Uh, click the like button, subscribe, and all the good stuff. And see you next time.